everybody. Brittany Tiller here. I'm the naturalist with Jefferson County Conservation and I just wanted to take a short little bit of time and kind of talk to you about some of the prescribed burns that you might be seeing smoke from in the coming days. So um, I'm out here at Jefferson County Park in what we call the Holmes Prairie. Um, yesterday we had a prescribed burn that we did and um, as you can see today, I'm standing in what we call the black. Um, and this is an area that has been burned. And so it looks like a lot of destruction initially, but prescribed burns are so important for the habitat, especially the prairie here in Iowa. And um, what we're really trying to do is recreate what the prairie is used to. So if you go back in time, back before European um, settlement, the prairie, dominated Iowa. It was our, our primary landscape that we had here in Iowa. And the thing that really shaped the prairie is fire. And so prairies and fire go hand in hand. In fact, if you take fire out of the mix, it can dramatically change the prairie. Prairies need fire. And so before um, we were here with drip torches and all the tools needed to start a prescribed fire, um, the Native Americans were actually starting prescribed fires or naturally they would have occurred um, from lightning strikes and other things like that. But the prairie um, needs fire and the reason I keep saying that is because the plants themselves depend on it. Some plants in fact can't even germinate unless they have the heat from a prescribed burn. Also, you can just see how it knocks back all of the fuel here and it lets that sunlight get right down onto this burnt, this black um, charred remains here. That lets that sunlight, that heat get down close to the ground and lets these prairie plants um, grow without competing through all the existing prairie grasses. Another thing that fires do is they keep back the plants that are not supposed to be in a prairie. And so for us here, that looks like a lot of invasive plants that aren't even supposed to be here in Iowa in the first place, but it can also be some of the native plants that are found in other areas, but maybe they don't like fire and therefore um, they didn't um, kind of evolve with the prairie plants per se. So um, our main goal is to really um, keep the health of the prairie intact and therefore when we have a healthy prairie habitat we have healthy wildlife we have a healthy ecosystem so that's why you'll see us burning some prairies uh, at some of our different areas that we manage